Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Uh, in today's video, we are going to talk about a question which was asked to me in Amazon interview. So this is a question on date basically and very interesting question. Uh, I will talk about it, discuss the solution. You can also try if you can give a better solution. Okay, let's try. So the question is this. Write a query to provide the date of nth occurrence of Sunday in future from given date. Which means let's say today is Saturday. Okay. Uh, so let, let's say the given date is 1st of January. Okay. Which is Saturday. So if someone uh, asks you which is the first occurrence of set, uh, Sunday after this date, then it will be 2nd, right? 2nd January. If someone asks you uh, second occurrence of Sunday from this date, it will be se uh, second is Sunday plus 7, 9. Third occurrence will be 16th. So like that, you can there can be any date given and you have to find nth occurrence of sunday okay hope the question is clear so let's start so in one uh, in the previous video we talked about date functions right so i will if you have not seen the videos uh, see that video first i will tag it somewhere here and then you watch this video so we will use weekday function so first we will find out what is the day of this given day is it Saturday? It is Sunday? Is it Wednesday? Whatever it is, right? So we will use date part function and we will find out the weekday. So date part function will give Sunday as first weekday, Monday as second weekday, Friday as sixth weekday, Sunday as seventh weekday in that manner, right? So what will happen? Let's say today is Saturday. So this is Saturday, uh, 1st of January. So what I have to do, I have to first these two coming Sunday and then I will add more weeks, whatever is the value, minus one. So let's say it is Saturday. So I will this second and then I will add two more weeks in that and I will get the value. Okay, so let's do it. So select, So I will use date add function, right? In date add function, I have to tell what I want to add, right? So I want to add days. So I will say day I want to add, right? How many days I want to add? So if it is a Sunday, Sunday 7, right, to reach Sunday, uh, uh, Saturday, uh, from Saturday to this Sunday, I need to add 1, right? If today is Friday to this Sunday, I need to add 2. So what I can do, I can do 8 minus, right, date part, weekday of what today's date. So what I will get, I will get 7 from here because this is first. So weekday for the today's date is 7 and 8 minus 7 is 1. So I will add 1. And in what I will add, I will add in today's date. So it will require 3 parameters, date add function. First parameter is what you want to add, number of days, how many days, 8 minus what is the weekday value, right? So if it is Saturday, it will be 1. If it is Friday, it will be 8 minus 6, 2, right? And it will I will add in the today date, given date basically. So if I run this, I should get 2 because first is Saturday, right? So see, I get 2nd January. Similarly, okay, so I got, let's say it is a Sunday now, right? So if it is a Sunday, what will happen? It will be 8 minus Sunday is 1. So I will add 7 more, right? So if it is a Sunday, I need to reach next Sunday, right? So similarly, I will get 9th of January, right? This is done. So we got upcoming Sunday. Now we have to add n minus 1 more Sundays, right? Because uh, the, the nth occurrence is let's say 3. So I, I need to find third occurrence in the future. So first occurrence though I have found from this, right? Now I need to add two more weeks, that's all, right? So I will just, so this date is there, in this I will do date add, I will again add date in this date. How many? I need to add weeks now. How many weeks? However, n minus 1. Because first occurrence I have found out here and then in that I will add this. I know it is little confusing but I hope it is clear, it should be weak. Okay. So if I run this now. So I got 23. So second is Saturday, third is first Sunday, 
right so this first is saturday right sec so let's run it again sorry for the confusion okay so first is saturday first occurrence is second so on second first sunday ninth second sunday and 16th third sunday so we got 16th if i make a second so first sunday will be ninth then second will be 16th and third will be 23 so it should be 23 so we got 23 so this is how it works let's give some other date let's give monday even if it is monday it will be same 23rd right because next sunday is 9th then 16th then 23 so let's run it for monday we got Monday, uh, 23rd right so this is how you can solve it uh, you should be very clear with this how to use date add functions and date part functions please watch my another video which i have created mainly on these date functions okay i hope this is clear let me know if you have any doubt and if you have any other better solution do let me know in the comment section thanks for watching it like the video and subscribe to the channel thank you